We're ordering breakfast pitas again. Yes. Still on the side of the road, we're going down the high felt, down towards Cropper's Dole. Right in front of us here, we've got Moscow Dam. Irrigation projects for the area. Absolutely beautiful. It all feels brand new. Choices that we make, it makes me and you. Here we go again. I think we're heading off to our home. Off to our next location. Not 100% sure where that is, but I know we need to check in after four. Heading further into Sekakuni land, just outside present day Rio Senegal, we find the fortifications built by Mapok, the first real king of the Ndebele. 48 kilometers north of Burgess Fort, Chache Heritage Site is central to the Bapeli Empire and the story of Sekakuni land, which stretched as far as Echo Caves and where a stalactite was used as a drum to warn of approaching dangers. Down in the riverbed, <coughs> it's the bottom of the Echo Caves where the Petty used to hide out from the Swazis and the Zulus. Floods are about this high. In the Bay River floods. Going through the tunnel, we're going to see what's on the other side. See you on the other side. Yeah. <laughs> the Welcome to Echo Cave. This is my Limpopo. Heading down Abel Araspas Pass and through the JG Stratum Tunnel, built in the 1920s, this definitely adds a touch of excitement to the journey, which finally ends in hood spray to the gateway to the Kruger National Park. A prosperous little town where we had some of the best food and wine in the region. Definitely one of the highlights through our tour of Southern Limpopo. This is the place where you come to your tasting. Welcome to the Venue Safari Wines in Hoodsprite. We do wine tastings here. We have over 40 different gin, craft gins from South Africa behind the bar here. And we do many gin tales, gin tastings, basically anything that's crafted, craft beers, craft vodka, craft whiskey. I have a massive variety over here. 